Have some yes. tips. I, we just, I don't know, wouldn't it be cool if, like, your husband were here to help talk yeah, through it? that might be helpful. It'd just be easier if Mike were here to, it might to be get a little this bit oh my Mike Feldman, everybody. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hi, husband. Hello, wife. Come on in, Mike. Oh, my gosh. You really surprised oh, me. Yeah. Okay. He was telling I'll me I can't Thank get you. out of the house this morning. It's all crazy at home. Hi, sweetie. We tried to get Vail to come, but she's booked on another morning show. <laughs> She she oh my gosh. She, she, she wouldn't do it. <laughs> Young lady. We're so excited for you guys. Oh my gosh. A, a girl and a boy. Yeah. It's just the best. Just like you guys. We, do, we try yeah. to do everything like the you guys. You know, I know. We choreograph <laughs> that just for television. <laughs> so give her your favorite tip, see. So this is for them, first of all. Uh, oh. Gets um, okay, so first know. of all, we're not parenting experts. Yes, and we're not are. sleep experts, but we do happen to be parents. Um, and so our first bit of advice might be controversial. All bets are off at bedtime. We've already covered that. Yes. Secondly, I think sharing is a little bit overrated. When you have a two-year-old in the house and a baby shows up and she has to share her parents, her home, yeah. her entire life with this new baby, I think it's okay for some things to still be veils. That's good because she likes things, to say mine all yeah, the time. I think that's okay. I, I honestly think that's all right. And then she can learn that some things belong to baby, right? And you can teach her to ask baby for a turn before she steals his teddy bear oh, okay. or his toy. Yeah, right. I like that. Um, yeah, the next one's don't overthink it. Right? Mm -hmm. Willie mm -hmm. can speak to this one with our with Lucy and when George was born. Yeah, I think that you have this big plan. Like, this is a huge moment in Lucy yeah. or Vale's life. And uh, Christina said, we have to buy a gift for Lucy so she feels like it's special for her. Lucy doesn't care about anyone but herself. Let's be honest. And Vail, <laughs> at age two. At age two. No, no, now that's what I mean. Does. At age two. And Vale will be the same way. So just let her have her thing and don't overthink I know how like, she's relating to the baby. The first time she meets the baby and all yeah. that stuff. Yeah. Just, yeah. Right. I she, mean, she, she knows there's something going on because we're trying to make her comfortable with it. Yeah. And she senses it. Oh my gosh. Right. <laughs> but as long as her world stays the same and grown ups follow her around, which is yeah. all she wants as a two year old, yeah. she's going to be fine. Okay, we're out fine. of time, but I have to say, how did this transform into this awesome segment for us when I have to say this is a great book? Christina Geis is the author, Buddy's Bedtime Battery. It's so cute. Run out and get it. It's really fun. Thank you. And by the way, there's more from them, including a read along featuring some faces you'll know from today. Check it out at today.com. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.